All right, welcome to everybody listening on the broadcast today to Frank Bailey Field this Wednesday evening. It is 6 o'clock here for our non-conference matchup between Williams College and the Union College Dutchman. I'll quickly go over those starting lineups if you didn't already hear them on the loudspeaker. So at attack for Williams College, Calvin Caputo. At attack number 16, uh, Finley McKnight. At attack number 30, Pierce Galvin. Um, on uh, long stick midfielder Eddie Lloyd, midfielder Owen Roji, long stick mid Ian DiPetrio. Then we've got faceoff specialist Noah Dubray, defenseman number 19 Sam Cragen, another defenseman number 35 Patrick Gall, and in goal we have number 25 Matthew Freitas. And now for the Dutchman. Um, in goal, we have number three, Dan Donahue. At attack, number four, Peter Burns. Another attackman, number five, Michael Shaw. Another attackman, number 12, Jake Mabardi. Another attackman, number 18, Justin Green. And for the midfielders, we have number 13, Peter Kipp. We have number 31, Archie McAvoy. We have a long stick midfielder, number 40, Seamus Foley. And defenseman, 34, Jack Thompson. And number 44, Clint Gordeaux. Dutchman will get their attackmen out here on the field. Zach Davis, Jake Mabardi, and Peter Kipp here up at the top of the field. Down below, Peter Burns, Michael Shaw, and in comes Justin Green. Now for the Dutchman. They'll set up and they'll run their first attack of the game. look inside there by Union to Jake Lombardi but the Williams defense just flooded all over him and stopped an easy goal there. Ball will make it over here on the near side to Justin Green. He'll work around his defenseman here trying to rush it in straight to goal. Good save there by Matthew Freitas. Lombardi up top with it now. Looks like we'll get a whistle. Is that a shot clock violation? I mean, we're moving the net, but... Looks like we'll get the yeah. shot clock reset to 55. All right, Justin Green. Over to Peter Kipp, Zach Davis. Back to Kip. Kip will hand that off to Green. Kip going off the field. I mean, slow down their offense a little bit to get yeah. the sub in. Archie McAvoy will hop on for him. Davis with it now. Hover up a shot. That'll go just wide, but Michael Shaw will pick that back up for Union. Only 15 on the shot clock up for this end line play. Burns with it now. Great save. Yeah, another good save by Freitas. Dutchman maintain control of the ball. Only eight seconds left now. Still have a little bit of time, but they're going to elect to sub on the defensive midfielder. Yeah. Still get a shot, but it's easily scooped up by Freitas. Yep. That's a flag down. Looks like a slashing penalty on Union. Davidson. Possibly John Sula with that one. Union is able to sub on their defensive midfielder, though. That's a great shot there by number 20, Spencer Goodbar. And Williams will go up 1-0. Great job. Just make the defense move, find the open guy, especially when you have a free play there. That's a great play from Williams. And his penalty is now wiped out. Looks like it was a holding penalty, so that will be wiped out. 
and we'll have an even man face off. All right, so Williams with the first point of the game. They lead 1-0, 12-16 left to go in this period. Back out on the X there is Matt Pilato for Union. Williams was uh, dominant in their last game, but they really struggled at the face-off X, only winning a very small percentage of them. I think they only had three or four face-off wins in their first game, so we'll see if they can improve here, but it might be a dominant day at the X for Union. Yeah, Matt Pilato has always been statistically very good for the Dutchman, but we'll get a face-off violation there, and it'll get picked up by uh, Cade Shuckman here for Williams. He'll bring it upfield, and they'll get their attackman on. In comes Ryan Johnson. Good movement there by Calvin Caputo. Jack Thompson not letting him get anything. Williams finally with all their offensive midfielders on. Now really ready to start their offense. Good bar will hand that ball off. to Johnson. Johnson trying to get it to goal. Shorty is now hung behind the cage. Williams trying to take advantage of this to get a feed to the inside. I'll hand that off to Goodbar over here on the near side. Getting guarded by Clint Gordeaux. Great check by Gordeaux. Puts the ball on the ground, but Williams is able to pick it back up. Only five on the shot clock. Williams has to go here. And they elect to just throw it into the corner. Nothing there for Williams on offense. Great job by the Union defense. Ball in the stick of Dan Donahue. He'll bring that up the field a little bit for the Dutchman. They can set up a bit of their offense, get their midfielders on. Ball now in the hands of Zach Davis to bring it up the field. Good ride by Williams. They forced uh, the long pass there, but Donahue's able to make it. It's a great clear for Union. All right, Green with it now on the near side. Roji on him. All right, Mavardi with it now. I'm sorry, that was Kip, and that'll be a turnover for the Dutchman that ball picked up by the Williams defense number 43 Ian DiPietro yeah DiPietro had a great takeaway there carried it up the field but ends up with a good turnover now back to Union ball Davis hands that ball up to Kip Kip and Green over there on the far side Davis right on the U Kip tries to hand that ball up right in front of the goal to Burns. Davis was trying to take uh, control of his shorty matchup there, but Williams was quick to si slide. Left the guy open on the middle, but Union's not able to complete the pass to get the goal. Davidson tries to hand that ball off to his teammate. Looks like it's going to be another turnover on Williams, and it'll be Dutchman ball. Quite a few sloppy turnovers by both teams right now. It looks like there'll be a timeout to talk it over for Union.
we'll get it started back up here. Union on the offense. I think it's good that both teams took some time to talk about all those turnovers. Maybe see if they can fix it up here with nine minutes left to go in the first period. Yeah, I'm sure uh, Williams is talking about how they're going to try to get another turnover here on this clear. It should be hard with the Union having this nice settled clear that they just talked about, but we'll see what happens. A lot of turnovers this season for Union in transition. All right, Thompson with the ball. Nice calm and collected by Thompson. Just draw the guy, dump it over him. Able to hand it back to Titus and... Cole Hartman will hop on. Oh, I'm sorry, that's Justin Green. No, is that Cole Hartman? No, that's Cole Hartman. <laughs> Matt Blasi. And Archie McAvoy. So Union's got a new lineup. Shot there by Michael Shaw. No good. Picked up by Friedhess. Another bad pass for Williams. They'll be able to pick up this one. Patrick Gall walking it up. Throws an overpass. That is a time violation. They do not get it over the midfield line in time. And now it's going to be Union Ball. Pushing it with pace right now. Going to pull it out and elect to sub out their defensive guys. Allows Williams to get out on their uh, long pole. All right. Michael Shaw over to McAvoy. He's got Belasi and Hartman to his left and right. Lombardi with the ball. He'll hand that off to McAvoy in front of the net. Trying to do something with it. Ball almost goes out of bounds. Picked up by Shaw. He'll hand that off to McAvoy back to Blasi. Another oh. cause turnover for Williams. Ball's on the ground, but comes back out to Union. Hartman with it now. Williams picking it up on the end line. They've had some trouble clearing with these overpasses. This one hits the ground. Peter Burns working to get that ball back for the Dutchman. Are they able to go get it over the line? And they are. All right, Roji with it now. He'll hop off the field, let some more attackmen on for Williams. Not a lot of scoring so far in this game, but a lot of turnovers. So far, the Union defense has been pretty solid in six on six with this Williams offense. Titus working hard on that Williams attackman, Pierce Galvin. Jack Thompson comes up with the ground ball. All right, Seamus Foley with it now. He'll hand that off to Clint Gordeau. Gordeau will bring it up for Union. And Michael Shaw with the ball in his net. Back around back for Burns. Kip, Green, and Davis, and Mobardi over there on the far side. The starting attackmen and midfielders now on for the Dutchman. Oh, good shot there. Zach Davis with the first goal of the game for the Dutchman. So score is going to be 1-1 with just under six minutes left to play in the first period. So we're all tied up here. Yeah, it's been an interesting game so far. Union has definitely had more opportunities on offense than Williams has, but some good takeaways by Williams along with some bad passes by Union have kept them to only one goal so far. It's only our third faceoff, 1-1 one, one so far, but... It's definitely looking like both teams are having a little bit of trouble clearing the ball. A few cause turnovers, a few forced turnovers, bad passes, but... We're all tied here at one. Face off one by Pilato. Ball into the hands of Donahue. Donahue calmly walking it up. Looking for one of the attackmen cutting. Ends up hitting Thompson. Good clear for Union. 
one of these teams is going to get their first loss of the season today. Williams is 1-0 with a win against Trinity last week, and Union is 3-0 with wins against Babson, Endicott, and remind me the last one. Springfield. There we go. Yeah, Williams not quite as highly touted as they were last season going in, but they looked pretty dominant against Trinity in their last game, so really a prove-it game for them here. Davis with the ball now. Looking to shoot like he just did last time. He'll hand that off to Green, and he'll take a shot, and that ball will slide past the goalie and roll on in. Great job by Union. They're attacking the short sticks right now, and it's working for them. Williams is quick to slide, but there, there's no help from the backside for Williams. Leaves the Union players wide open on the crease. And a good shot gets Union up by one. That'll be Green's third goal of the season. He had two in their last game against Springfield. Face-off one again by Matt Pilato. I think he's oh, I think he's three and four. No. Yeah, I think he's won three out of the four face-offs here yeah. already today. And the one loss was on a violation. Was on a violation. Yeah, he's looking pretty dominant at this X so far. Pretty cleanly winning it, going behind himself, picking it up. Williams has struggled at the face-off X so far this season, so kind of what we're expecting. We'll see if Williams tries to make any changes to improve that. A couple minutes ago, it looked like Union got some new attackmen out in the field, but now they're back to that starting lineup. Green with a the shot there right into the stick of Freitas. Freitas tries to hit a home run clear. It bounces, but it lands in a Williams stick still. Yeah, Ian DiPietro with it now, just trying to hand it off. Williams He'll get it to make. McKnight. Williams tried to make profit off of that advantage, but they're not able to do so. All the Union defenders got in quite quick. Caputo was able to hand it off to his teammate right in front of the net. Looked like Donahue got a piece of it, and it rolled out of bounds. All right, that's McKnight now getting guarded by Foley. Good bar with it up top now. Running in, he'll take a shot and that'll go in. All right, so that's one goal there for Spencer Goodbar, making it 2-2, 3.15 left to go in the first period. Williams misses an easy shot to start off that offensive possession, but able to get it back when Goodbar just hits a nice one, putting it top corner down while running down the alley. Great goal for Williams to tie it up here. Yeah, that'll be good. Bar's third goal of the season so far with two goals against Trinity. So he's having a pretty good start to his 2023 season. Back out on the X. Dubray and Pilato. Looks like it's a little bit of a scramble. Nick Denave's out there trying to help Pilato out, getting shoved around. Major scramble, and it's picked up by Jake Titus, who's going to take it right to goal. Titus sees a Williams defender in front of him, decides to pull it out. Smartly, he's surrounded by three purple jerseys. Hands it off to Burns behind the net. Able to keep possession and get all their subs in. All right, we got that second line of attackmen on now. Belasi and Hartman and McAvoy over on the far side. Seeing if this lineup can get their first goal of the game. McAvoy with a good shot. It's going to get picked up by Eddie Lloyd into the stick of Fritas. Back to Lloyd, who hits the ground, is making the pass across the field. Cragen with it now. Just trying to get it past the midpoint line. That's been a struggle for Williams today so far. Ball in the hands of Johnson. Williams looking to get more attackmen on the field. Ball now with Nicholson. 
jumps off the field. That'll bounce out of play. be a penalty on, on number 40, Seamus Foley. And now we've got uh, Pierce Glavin to bring it in on the offensive side for Williams. 138 left to go in the period. Williams was pretty prolific in man up in the last game, going four for eight. A lot of opportunities and a lot of goals out there. We'll see how successful they are here versus Union. All right, Glavin over to Shapiro. Shapiro with it now, back to Glavin. Over there to Johnson, he'll hand it off around the back side of the net to McKnight. And then Shapiro getting guarded pretty heavily there by the Union defense. Shapiro rips one from 15, goes over the net. Williams able to chase it down. They got 15 seconds here on the shot clock. 49 on the game clock, seeing if they can capitalize here and put another goal up on the board before the period ends. That'd be big if Williams could get a lead here, get some momentum going into the break. And the official checks out the net. Shot clock resets. With a change in the game clock, too. All right, shot clock and game clock both read 52. Nope. Game clock reads 52, shot clock reads 15. Okay. There we go. We have a few changes there, but now we're ready to go. Good bar. Shapiro misses that pass from behind the net. Stays on the ground, shot clock's gonna run out. Yeah, that was a bad pass there for our, from Caputo to Goodbar. Forces Williams to give up that opportunity. And now Union will have the next 27 seconds to put another point up on the board for their team. Union still serving their penalty. Don't know if they're, how aggressive they're gonna be here at the end of the period. But Williams is gonna be, they got the turnover. Only 13 seconds left to clear. Oh, Mike Shaw trying to get that ball back. Petrio was running for his life, threw it up the field. Free test will just toss that ball away to the other end of the field. And that'll be it for our first period. The score is Union 2, Williams 2. So we're all tied up here, and we'll be back in just a few minutes.
right, so we'll start this second period off. 15 minutes on the clock. Luke McHugh out on the X for the Dutchman. And Noah Dubray out on the X for Williams. Williams only has oh, sorry, made continue. an adjustment. They put DiPietro, the long pole, at the faceoff to try to fix the situation they've been having here. And it doesn't seem to have helped. Easy win back to inside. Donahue over to Foley. Union able to get over the midfield line just in time. McHugh will head off the field. So will Titus. And Green will hop on there on the attack. We've got Green with the ball now. Tries to hand that pass off to Mabardi, see if he's able to pick it up. Williams saying aggressive on this ground ball. Yeah. Mabardi with a pass to Burns, who will hammer one in there for Union. They'll go up by one early in the second. It's 3-2 Dutchman. Only one minute in to the second period. Mabardi surrounded by three purple jerseys, able to pull off a magic trick, get through, and it leads straight to the goal for Burns. That'll be Burns' seventh goal of the season so far, tied up there with Jake Mabardi. Mabardi with 13 points now and Burns with 16, so the two of them are having a dominant season over the past four games. Williams keeping DiPietro on the faceoff, giving him another try. They're trying to eliminate the backside. Just trying to make this a ground ball. Luke McHugh will pick that up for the Dutchman. He'll hand that off to Burns. Burns getting chased down there by uh, Sam Cragen. Lotta lost his glove on that one. Luckily the refs didn't call a penalty. Davis over to Green. Kip up top with it now. Kip goes down the alley. Early slide for Williams. Keeps him out of inside. He now is a short stick, though. Mabardi trying to wrap it around. Kip tries to pick it up, but it'll roll out of bounds. Burns will bring it back in here for Union. Green with it now. Green's got a short stick. Takes him down the goal line. He'll run that right to goal. Freitas looks like he got a piece of it. Williams is really quick with the doubles here. Union's going to have to find out where to move the ball to get some easy goals. And the ball hits the floor. It's in the crease, but the goalie's out. It's up in the air. A little bit of a scrap there for the ball. Ball's now in the hands of Davis. Up top, running around with it. Over to Kip. Kip will fire it in and in. And the Dutchman will go up by two. 12.40 left to play in the second. Good movement there by, by Union, but Williams yeah. was right with them the whole time. Williams played really aggressive there. Got a little bit unlucky on the bounce of the ground balls. But that's what happens when you play, aggress play aggressive. If it doesn't work out for you, you leave Kip wide open for an easy shot like that. And that'll be uh, Kip's seventh goal of the season so far. All right, face off one by Pilato. Looks like Donahue has to kind of pick it up. It'll drop out of his stick. Titus able to pick that up for Union, or sorry, Pilato able to pick that up for Union, gets by his two defenders. He'll hand that off to Longstick John Sula, who will hammer one in, but it'll get saved by uh, Fritas. Now in for the long run back, back to play defense. Williams able to clear, now slowing it down, getting their subs in. Jank Thompson with some good 
defensive work there. Quick shot for Williams, and that was a ground ball. Lavin able to pick it up, passes it out to his teammate Shapiro. Uh, and that's Ryan Johnson there with a the good shot. From the end line. 30 seconds left on the shot clock. Gordeaux working on the attackman over there on the far side. Picked up by Shapiro up top. He'll hand that off to Johnson. Johnson down the alley, has a shot, passes around back. And looks like that'll be another turnover for Williams. And Patrick Riley will pick it up for the Dutchman. He'll hand that off to Donahue right there in the crease. Now to McAvoy. McAvoy will try and that bring that up past the, the midway point. Union struggling to get it over half field right now. Donahue is going to run it up himself. Donahue and that's a good catch there by Michael Shaw. Shaw actually <laughs> seems to have dropped it. Oh. Williams ball. They're having a little bit of trouble clearing now too, but they're able to get it to Davidson. And Davidson carries it over. Ball Nichols. now in the hands of Goodbar over there on the far side. Back to Johnson. Guarded by Sh Patrick Riley. Shapiro dodging from up top. Turns around, gets it to Johnson. He has a short stick. Definitely looking to go down the right alley here. Slide down for off sides there. I have another man off opportunity for Williams. They weren't able to take advantage of the last one. Williams setting up in a 2-3-1, two, two guys behind the cage. Three in the middle, one up high. Really starting the ball on the left wing. All right, Johnson with the ball now here on the near side by the 10. Great check by Sula, puts the ball on the ground, makes its way to Donahue. Last time we saw Williams man up on defense, they were very aggressive. I would assume we'll see them do the same here, but this penalty is quite short. And Williams picks it up already. All right, into the hands of Roji. Back on the far side for Goodbar at the 40. Goodbar to Shapiro. And in comes Glavin here on the near side for Williams. Johnson. Johnson has the short stick. He's tried to take advantage of this matchup a few times. Likes to stay in his right hand. Patrick Riley, though, not letting him get anywhere. Good save, Dan Donahue. Donahue will hand that up there to John Sula. Able to spin around. Good bar. Great home run pass by Donahue, but Williams gets back in the hole very quickly and negates the transition opportunity. A quick shot gives Williams the ball back. Shapiro had a little trouble clearing there, but able to make it through on his own. Beating the three Union attackmen. Yeah, we've seen a lot of difficult clearing opportunities for both these teams. 
We'll get a nice shot there by Glavin, but it'll go just wide. Seamus Foley, good defensive work there. Williams able to put another shot on Donahue. Great. That one will come from McKnight. Yeah, great check by Foley there. Makes the shot go awry. Uh, Williams finds this ground ball. They're able to pick it up. All right, good bar with it now. Williams looking to maybe settle things down. Maybe run a play. Glavin pulls a short stick behind. Probably seeing an early side slide from Union here. Not necessary. Glavin doesn't get anything. That's Wimrell with it now. Shane Smith not letting him get anywhere. He'll shoot it. He'll go off the left side of the goal. Seven seconds left. Williams is going to sub their guys, but we might still have another opportunity to score here. They feed to the inside. The ball hits the ground. And that'll be a shot clock violation on Williams. Union ball on the end line. All right, Donahue with the ball behind the net. Off to Thompson. And they'll hand that off to midfielder Zach Davis who will try and get it past the midway point. He'll hand that ball off to Kit, but he'll drop it. Looks like... Good pick up there by Gray Humphrey before he headed off the field, able to keep the ball in Union possession. Yeah, All right. definitely saved another turnover off a bad drop in transition. Yeah, definitely seen a ton of those this game. Kip with it now. Looking like he may shoot the ball. He'll step outside. Davis back to Kip. Kip's got a short stick now. Definitely looking to shoot, but Got to no hand room. that off to Green over here on the near side by the 30. Green with some quick footwork there. Hands it off behind the net to Burns. Burns with the shot. And a goal, his second of the game. Burns leaps into the air and puts one past. All right, so that'll be Burns' eighth goal of the season so far. Top scorer for Union last year, breaking all sorts of records in the uh, NCAA tournament and in the Liberty League. This game is definitely looks tight, but now we're on a 3-0 Union run in this quarter. And Williams hasn't had much success in the faceoff. They go back to a short stick here. I don't know what number it is yet unable to really make anything happen there out there on the X. That was a new face-off specialist, uh, Ian Kim, a first year for Williams. Unable to win it though. Ball in the hands of the Dutchman now. Shaw will hand that off to Kip and Green up top by the 40. Now over to Mabardi. Union starting in an open set. Union's got some good positioning now. Green will run it in. Over to Kip. Kip shot and over Kip the top. shot and scores. Kip just got his hands free right in the middle of the field. That's what he's been scoring all year. And that's going to be four unanswered goals here by Union. Two for Kip and two for Burns. Williams, they're not playing bad right now, but against an offensive powerhouse like Union, it's tough to keep pace when you're not getting as many possessions. The only way Union's get, uh, the only way Williams is getting possessions right now is on turnovers because they cannot seem to find a guy on their sideline to win this faceoff. They tossed out Kim again there on the X, and once again, Pilato and the Dutchman are able to pick it up. Kip over to Davis. Williams definitely has to be aggressive on this defensive possession to try to get something going for their offense. Green. Back to Davis. 
quick slide leaves Green open. Takes a shot. Goes far right. Burns with the shot there. Wide again. 30 seconds on the shot clock here. Davis makes it to the sideline to pick it up here for Union. Davis 24 guarded seconds. A, guarded by a short stick on the wing. Looks like he's going to dodge. He gets a switch. And he'll take a shot, and that'll go in. What an incredible shot there from Zach Davis. Davis with a good dodge over the middle and a little indecisive for a Union defender. Doesn't, uh, for a Williams defender, doesn't slide quick enough. Leads an easy goal for him. Now five unanswered goals here from Union. Williams, they started off the game being very aggressive on defense. A lot of double teams, quick early slides. They seem to slow down here a little bit, and it's really hurting them. Now Williams takes a timeout to talk it over. Yeah, I think first and foremost, Connor, they got to get someone out there on the X that can win a faceoff and, and hopefully get possession and bring it down to their offensive zone. If they can't do that, you know. You, you need one hell of a defense if you're not going to win any faceoffs. Yeah, exactly. Because then you're, you're just always a possession behind. Yeah, or they need to go back to what they were doing in the first where they were causing all these turnovers and yeah. really putting the Dutchman under pressure. But so far in this second... It's been all Dutchmen. They have to do something to stop the bleeding, even if they can just tie up the face-off X, get a ground ball, win one of those. But right now, it's just face-off win into goal for Union. A couple of those straight in a row with no chances for the Williams offense even to respond. All right, and we're back on here. 419 left to go in the half. Union leads 7 to 2. Five unanswered goals here in the second period. We'll get back out here on the faceoff X. Williams continuing with first year Ian Kim at the X. He's 0 for 3 right now, but who knows this could be this could be his moment. Palato just seems to be toying once they move their wing guys forward. He goes backwards, when they move it backwards, he goes forwards, and there's a violation for Kim, and the ball goes straight to Union. Yeah, unfortunately, not a great start to, to Kim's season here at uh, Frank Bailey Field going 0-4 on the, on the X, but who knows, maybe he'll pick it back up. Definitely tough when they throw you in after not winning a single faceoff, hoping you'll do something. Yeah, morale isn't, isn't great out there on the X. All right, Blossy with the ball now, getting guarded heavily there uh, by Owen Roji. Quick Blossie. slide, puts Blossy on the ground, and the ball is down. He'll drop it, but it's going to get picked up by uh, Cole Hartman. We'll get a whistle here. Union calls a timeout with their players getting beaten up down there behind the net. It's uh, good there by Williams being aggressive, but got to be able to pick up that ground ball also. Yeah, no, for sure. They've had quite a few cause turnovers where they haven't been able to get the ball, which is definitely common, but they definitely need those ground balls at this point to try to close this five-point deficit. Yeah, no, Williams needs to go back to the method in which they were playing in the first period with their first goal and a quick unanswered you know, second goal pretty early in the game. A lot of cause turnovers and really making the Dutchman work for it. But right now it's, it's all union. 3.43 left to go in the half. Thanks for everybody for tuning in so far. Parents, friends, uh, Union Lacrosse alumni, and anyone listening here on the broadcast, we're happy to have you.
taking up the ball on the sideline here. All right, McAvoy with it now by the 30. McAvoy takes a shorty to the middle of the field, passes it off. And that's Hartman over there on the far side. Hartman also has a shorty that he's looking to attack. Shaw will make it there to the end line and pick it up for the Dutchman. He'll bring it back into play, hands it off to Archie McAvoy over here just behind the goal line. Over to Burns. Williams has been playing very effective against this two-man game. Good communication from them. Ooh, McAvoy looks like he lost the ball there on that pass from Burns, and uh, Williams with an opportunity here. Ball picked up there by Ian DiPietro. Yeah, DiPietro gets it over, ends up in the hands of his goalie. All right, Cragen with it now to bring it up past the midway point. Cragen runs it over. Oh, and another sloppy pass there by, by Williams. They're unable to regain control. That was a really important possession for Williams to try to stop the bleeding and get a goal after five unanswered, and they just throw the ball away. Yeah, looked a little rushed, looked a little too fast, not set up quite well enough here if you're gonna if you're gonna beat the Union defense. Union just waiting for their subs. They're gonna play some settled offense here. No need to rush. Green's got a dodge to the right hand side of his defenseman. Tries to hand that off to uh, to Shaw who sits right in front of the net. All right, there's a turnover there. Williams now with the ball. Kip tried to go inside and got hit by a flurry of checks putting the ball on the ground, and Williams is finally able to pick one up. Roji running it past uh, the U here. Ooh, that's a broken stick on his back by Lombardi. Williams acting like they're going to go quick, but I'm assuming they're going to try to milk this possession a little bit after not having the ball for so long. Shapiro holds it up top. Back over there for Johnson on the far side by the 30. He'll dodge around Jake Titus. Hand that back up to Shapiro here at the 30. Glavin dodges the alley versus short stick. Sides against the shot. Good bar. Back to Shapiro. Good bar with it now, guarded by Gordeaux. Good bar gets a step, but the quick slide makes him turn around. Here's Glavin with the ball now. He'll take a shot, and that'll be the first goal uh, for Williams here in the second. Williams finally able to get a takeaway, not mess up the clear, and then get a goal quickly. This Williams offense is definitely dangerous, but we haven't seen them much in this quarter. Barely any possessions for them, but that's a quick goal there. Maybe gives them a little bit of momentum. Looks like we've got a new face-off specialist here for Williams, Ian DiPietro. They put DiPietro on before. The long pull face-off's a good idea to try to tie up the face-off guy and get a ground ball, but it didn't work on the two he did earlier. And it doesn't work now. Looks like Pilato will pick it up here for Union. Pilato just too fast for the defenseman DiPietro. We got Mabardi, Davis, Kip, Green waiting to come on here for the Dutchmen, and they'll run their offense here for the last 31 seconds of the half. Union leads by four. Dutchmen could have a big goal here to kind of silence any momentum on the Williams sideline going into half. Yeah, Dutchmen have definitely proven they can, they can work their way around that Williams defense. Green with the ball now. He'll take a shot. We'll get a flag thrown there by the ref over by the 40. Nine seconds left for this man up opportunity for Union. Williams needs to hold here to gain some momentum going into half. Williams man down defense was very effective last week. Trinity going 0 for 4 on their man up opportunities. Looks like Ian DiPietro will sit here for 
Williams with the man up opportunity for the last six seconds of the half. Williams they're pushing out hard behind the cage. Union just running, gonna run out the half and try again for this man up after the halftime. All right, so Union leads seven to three, and we'll be back in 15 minutes here um, at the end of halftime for the third period.
right, welcome back to the broadcast. 15 minutes on the clock here, start of the second half. Union on the offense now. Zach Davis with up, with the, up by the 35. He'll hand it off to Shaw. Back to Burns around the back of the net. Union, this is their first man up of the day. Yeah, number 43. Uh, Ian DiPietro is sitting now for, for Williams. The ball hits the ground and another flag flies. A little bit of a controversial one there. Shot goes blocked by Freitas. Picked up by Union. Shaw will hand that off to Davis. Davis now to Green. Ball hits the ground again. The refs do not blow possession for Williams. Still fighting for it. Union picks it up. Picked up by Green. He'll hand it off to Shaw. Shaw will take a shot. It'll get blocked by uh, by Friedman once again. Friedas once again. Williams finally picks up the ball, so the flag can be called. It will be two men down here. I don't know how much time we have left on that first penalty. It can't be much. DiPietro comes back on the field. Yeah, it's looking like that first penalty might have run out, or no? Looks like they just. No, we got a uh, we got Cragen and Nicholson sitting now for Williams. Williams might have just snuck the Petro back on the field because they need him there for this defensive set. All right, we got Mabardi there on the far side by the twenty to bring it in now for the Dutchman. The officials talking it over with the Williams coach right now. Williams finally wants to know how much is left on this first penalty, considering we're already a minute into the first to the second half. Oh, it looks like two penalties were called. The penalty from the first half has been released. Yeah. We have two new ones, both one full minutes. One for slashing, one for interference. So. Union, two men up now. All right, Shaw with the ball and a shot blocked by Frida's picked up by uh, Williams Will here now. Williams fighting for it, Union has it. Williams drops back into the hole. Another shot blocked by Frida's, he runs after it. Ooh, and the official calls it for Union. Interesting. Definitely a close run out there. All right, Green with the ball now. Let's set the play in motion. 30 Burns. seconds left on the penalty, and they Union throws the ball away. Yeah, that pass from Burns intended for Davis will go just above his head. That ball will end up in the hands of uh, Finley McKnight here for Williams. Williams still has 15 seconds left on the penalty. They'll definitely try to run it out here. Union not pressuring the issue right now. Looks like both teams will just let the penalty run out. All right, we got Goodbar and Johnson up top at the 40. For Williams, Johnson with the ball now, guarded by Sula. Shapiro comes in off the last penalty. Now all even. Gray Humphrey guarding Shapiro. Shapiro will take a shot, blocked by Donahue. Shapiro definitely high step there, but still a tough shot going across your body down the alley. Glavin with it now. He'll run back around the net, guarded by Titus. And he'll take a shot, almost no look, in between the legs of Donahue. And Williams will get their first goal, first goal for both teams here. And that's of the second half. Two straight goals for Williams. Glavin there taking advantage of the short stick Titus. And Union just unwilling to slide to help him leads to a goal for Williams. Union normally pretty slow to slide. They trust their short sticks, but there you definitely needed someone to help Titus. See if Union continues their dominance in the faceoffs here. That's Luke McHugh there to pick it up for the Dutchman. McHugh picks it up, but. That was Noah Dewberry, the faceoff specialist for Williams, unable to, to capitalize there on the X. 
Looks like Williams. DePietro is keeping it on the ground. Williams seems to believe they're on offense. And that was definitely their mistake because their attackman will head back off the field. No, they'll stay on. <laughs> they're just waiting for the guys to sub. There's a flag down. That's why they're switching. It's going to be a man up for Williams. Looks like that penalty will be on number eight, Luke McHugh, there for Union. All right, cross yeah. check Cross there. checking there on Luke McHugh for Union. Williams on the man up here. 12 10 left to go in the third period. Union leads 7 4. Shapiro and Johnson up top there. All right, good bar. Over to Shapiro. Back to Johnson by the 20. Johnson holding it on the wing. Just back up to Shapiro. Good bar with it now in his stick. Over on backside to McKnight. Not too much movement here by Williams yet. No opening. McKnight to Johnson. Good bar. Shapiro. They're just moving that ball around quick, making those Union defensemen run. Williams finally decides to take a shot. Goes high over the net. Nothing too creative there from Williams. McKnight to start that clock again for Williams here. And Donahue will pick up that failed shot there for the Dutchman. Still with the ball in his stick. He'll hand that off to his defenseman, John Sula. Sula able to get to an attackman. Williams gets all their subs in. All right, Mabardi. Sula's staying on the field trying to play some offense. Decides against it and runs off. Hartman will hop on for Sula. McAvoy over there by the 45. Matt Belasi looking to come on. Lassie's got a step, rips one, and it goes in. Williams just a little slow, trying to sub along with Union. A step behind leads to a goal for Union. Puts their lead back to four points. Yeah, that was absolutely fantastic goal there by Matt Belasi. Puts Union up eight to four. It's going to be his fourth goal of the season so far here. First goal in today's game. We'll head back out to the X there. Luke McHugh again for Luke. Union. Williams able to tie them up a little bit on this faceoff. and looks like one of their attackmen is able to pick up the ball. Bad pass. Goes out of bounds. It's Union ball. Williams had a big advantage there with the Union faceoff guy still being on the field. Unable to take advantage of it just due to poor ball movement. Union's going to hold on to this and get their subs. Yeah, over there on the far side, Mabardi, Kip, Davis, and in comes Green at the 40 here on the near side. Green guarded by Shuckman. We'll hand that off to Shaw, and that'll be another bad pass there by Union. Pass for Shaw from Green. Oh, and another turnover there for Williams. It's get picked up by Mavardi. Shuckman the Dutchman. tried to run it, but somehow turned it over while trying to get past a few Union attackmen. So those attackmen will stay on here for Union. Ball and Green stick back to Davis over to Kip. Mabardi running the ball in now. Williams has been able to cause a lot of mistakes on defense, but made enough of their own to offset the possession deficit. Davis around back for Shaw. Shaw trying to knock one in, running around the other side of the goal. Burns to start play again here for the Dutchman. 35 left on the shot clock. Burns elects to dodge. Shoots and is blocked by Fuidas. 
got Davis over there on the end zone. Davis hands it off to Burns. Ball hits the ground. DiPietro oh. running after it. DiPietro struggles to pick that up. It's picked up by uh, Mabardi over there. Five left on the shot clock. Pass goes high, and it's going to be Williams' ball. Good job there by DiPietro. Wasted a lot of the shot clock by putting that ball on the ground. Ball makes a risky but good pass to Shuckman to get the ball up the field. Williams subbing on their offensive men. Ball now in the hands of Romrell for Williams. Back to Bates. Looks like we've got some new guys on the field here for Williams on the attack. That's Caputo behind the net, guarded by Thompson. Caputo takes a shot, caught by Donahue. Donahue moving the ball with ease. He'll hand that off all the way to the 45 there. Corey great. Humphrey with the ball now. Great clear by Donahue. Walks it up, calm and collected, and gets the easy pass over. Hartman, McAvoy, and Velocity to come on now. Velocity with the most recent goal in this game for Union. McAvoy running in. He's going to get knocked down by the Williams defender. Able to keep the ball. Mabardi. Back to McAvoy. All right, Burns with it now. Tries to go straight to the net. And it'll be a Williams ball. I call Burns in the crease. Shaw will hop off there for Union. Titus will hop on. Gall walking up with it. Decides to try to run over the midfield line. Passes it to a short stick. That's Owen Roji. Now good bar with it again. In comes uh, Johnson. And Shapiro over here on the near side at the 30. Johnson running around with that ball. Johnson has a short stick. We know he likes to dodge on them. Guarded by Patrick Riley pretty heavily over there. Riley not really letting him do much. He'll hand that ball off. Ball now in the stick of uh, Shapiro. Good bar with it now. Good bar gets a switch onto a short stick. Tries to attack. Riley on him again. Quick shot goes wide. Williams chases it down. 19 seconds left on the shot clock. Williams is going to have to go quick here. All right, that's Glavin with it now. Guarded by Titus. Glavin's trying to run it in. He'll hand that off in the middle of the goal to Caputo, and they're unable to make anything happened there so it'll be Dutchman ball Titus running with it now past the 40 past the 30 quick clear but no numbers advantage for Union they elect to pull it out Denave with it now able to keep the ball ball on the stick of Shaw he's getting double manned here at the 45 looking for more men to come on and help him he'll hand that off to Kip and Davis who runs to the far side of the field and Green lined up with his uh, two fellow attackmen here Kip goes down the alley nothing there resets looking for a wing dodge wraps it around but not enough angle the ball's going to go out Union ball. Oh. Yeah, Union 
Brandon Ball on the chase. Calling for a shot clock reset there. Yep, 57 on the shot clock. 4.15 left to go in the third. Green will run it in here. Hand that off to Mabardi. Mabardi right in front of the goal, and he'll try to rip one in, but that'll be a turnover. Mabardi wide open, but then, uh, but Gall comes with a perfectly timed check to stop the goal there. That's Davidson to bring the ball down there for Williams now. And on the far side, Glavin. Williams subbing all of their midfielders. They won't stop them from attacking the net, that's though. A, a good shot there by McKnight, but it's going to go just off the left side of the post. But Williams will bring that ball back in, and they'll stay on the offense. Yeah, he caught the defense sleeping a little bit on that uh, subbing exchange. Got a good shot off, but not quite enough to get the goal. Bates over to Romrell. Romrell now guarded by uh, Shane Smith. Shane Smith pushing out far. Rommel probably going to dodge here. Takes him down to the goal line. But nothing there for him. Romrell tries to hand that off to McKnight, who will take a shot. Shot goes off the post. Donahue dives, but it's not quite enough. It's going to be Williams' ball. Yeah, we'll get a shot clock reset, too, here. Another shot goes wide. Williams chases it down again. Yeah, good shot there by Romrell once again. Trying to take advantage of his matchup. Glavin over to Bates here on the near side around the back of the net. Bates looking for a feed. Can't find one. Turns around. Has some space on the inside. Oh. Takes a shot. Good shot there by Caputo and that ball will bounce off what looked like the rim of the net. Not too sure. Could have been a stick. Doesn't look like they're resetting the shot clock. The refs stop it. A lot of people yelling for the reset. It finally comes. Yeah, we will get a reset here on that shot clock. Yep, Romrell dancing around at the top of the field. Got a step on his short stick. Passes it back to an open man, but the pass is dropped. Union has some transition here. A bad pass kills the play. Williams to clear. <laughs> Yeah, that pass by John Sula just did not connect Golf. to who he wanted it to. Yep. Good bar over to Johnson. Quite a few offensive opportunities these past couple of minutes for Williams, but none have made it in so far. Down four points with only two minutes left in the third. They're going to got to make something happen. Oh, and we got a flag thrown there. That's going to be a penalty on Union. Looks like Williams will go man up here. It's going to be a slashing penalty one minute. This might be the difference William needs to finally put one in the net. Haven't put one in since earlier in the third quarter. All right, so we'll get a slashing penalty here on number 39, Gray Humphrey. 145 left to go in the period. 60 seconds on the shot clock here for Williams on the man up opportunity. Goodbar will receive the ball here at the the 15. Last man up. Uh, Williams was very stagnant. Not able to make much happen. Johnson with the shot. Seems like Williams is just looking to nail one of these outside shots. Haven't tried to really put it in the middle on these man ups yet. Shapiro. Shapiro had one there but elected not to send it. Looks and like he lost the ball there to Patrick Riley now for Union, who will run it all the way up the field. Looks like he might get tripped, but we'll, yeah, and we will get a flag on that play, so that'll be a tripping call there. I don't know if it's going to be an offsides, a trip, a slash. So many things went wrong there for Williams that could have been called. All Williams can do here now is make sure in this last 
minute 10, they don't let Union get another goal. It's going to be a holding penalty. 30 seconds. It's better than a slash for Williams. Only 110 left in the quarter, though. Yeah, so 15, Caputo will uh, sit for this holding penalty, and Union will be on the man-up opportunity, looking to extend their lead to five. They lead by four at the moment here with one minute, 10 seconds left to go in the third period. Williams has been looking much better in this quarter than the second quarter where they let up five straight, but still down by four. Puts it at a very hard to attain comeback if Union can put this goal in. Oh, it looks like Union's also serving a penalty. We're playing five on five here. Yeah, I don't think we ever released that penalty. Oh, yeah, yeah. 39, yeah. Looks like they're ready to come in, though. Yeah, and that penalty is now released. Humphrey will stand up, and Davis will come up on the field at the 40. He'll hand that off to the far side to Kip, around back for Burns, up top for Davis. Union only has about <coughs> 10 more seconds of man up, and it releases. Now all even. It's a Burns tries to hand it in front. Shot on the doorstep, but Free just able to stop it before it rolls in. Now Williams' ball trying to clear. They get it over the midline. Five seconds left in the quarter. Williams has to go fast. Davidson running with it now. Looks like he'll just kind of keep the ball in his stick as the game clock runs out here on the third period. Uh, we'll be back in just a few minutes. Union leads 8-4. to four. All right, welcome back to the broadcast. For the last time today, 15 minutes on the game clock. Fourth quarter, Union leads 8-4. to four. We'll hop back out there on the X. Matt Pilato for Union. I think Williams has the freshman out. Or maybe not. Never mind. Can't quite tell who that is at the moment. Oh, that's uh, Noah Dubray. So that's their... their Signature face-off specialist. Oh, we'll get a quick turnover there caused by uh, Union. Pilato with the ball now. He'll hand that off to Titus. Looks like he loses control of the ball a little bit. No one really knows where it is, and it ends up in the stick of the goalie, Matthew Friedis. Two turnovers there. Looking at the third, Union back with the ball again. Passes it to Sula. Yeah, long stick Sula now with the ball. He'll hand that off to Blasi. Looks like Union's going to settle a little bit after those several turnovers in a row. 
sorry, not Blasi. That's a uh, Mabardi and uh, of course Kip and Davis, and in comes Green now, starting lineup on the field. Green dodging from a pie. Doesn't have anything. Throws it away. All right, Davis with it now. Over to Shaw. Shaw has a short stick, takes advantage of it, and there's a goal. Just a quick one-step dodge on the short stick midi. Nails one top corner against Fridas. There we go. That'll be his first of the game, and that'll bring Shaw's total to seven goals so far this season over the course of these four games. Who knows? Maybe he'll get a second one here before the game runs out. We'll head back out there onto the, the face-off X. Williams looking to maybe turn this game around, maybe cut down that deficit by just a little bit. Williams has been a lot more successful since halftime. They've been able to win a few face-offs off of some ground balls. They haven't bled as many points as they did in the second quarter. That's another Union face-off win. Yeah, Plata will take that from Dubray, and he'll hand that off there to Nick Denave. Denave quickly gets rid of it and then runs off the field. Union just looking to do what they did in the first, in the second quarter. Face off win, goal, face off win, goal, face off win, goal. And with Williams' history on the, on the X right now, they're not able to stop it. All right, Kip, Davis, Green. Davis still with the ball. He'll take a shot. Chased down by Union. Burns off the end line. Up top there for Green. Green will take a shot, too. Bounces off of one of the Williams defenders. Throws out of bounds. Called a shot. Union's going to keep it. Yeah, Mike Shaw to bring it in now at the 40. He'll hand that off to Green. We got a shot clock reset anyways. Yep, Union with a lot of time here and no rush. Green dodging from high again. Davis at the 30. Davis rips one. Freitas gets a piece of it. The Union's got the ball back, and they're attacking the net. And that's Burns to take that shot. That first shot caused a reset, so we're back at 56 seconds on the shot clock. And we got Kip to Green. Green has a short stick again. Goes down the left alley. Guarded by Shuckman. Green making his way around. Hand that off to Shaw. Around the back of the net to Burns. Burns at the step, shoots, goes over the net, stays Union ball. No contact. Burns, hand that off there to Kip here on the near side. He'll dodge left, then right. Kip now has the short stick off the switch. Decides to shoot, nails his defender in the head. Ball goes high, but Union's able to chase it down. Only eight seconds left on the shot clock, though. I don't know if Union will elect to try to score here. They will roll it away. They keep their offensive midfielders on the field. Get a feed to the inside, but the shot goes nowhere. Yeah, again, right idea by Burns and Shaw there. Shaw with the shot. Unable to make that connect, but it was a good attempt there by Union. Yeah, it was a great idea. Just a good check by a couple of Williams defenders prevented the shot from coming off. All right, good bar with the ball now. Williams able to get the clear. Now settled in offense. Johnson up top. Both teams able to get all their subs. Shapiro with it now. 
Go shot. Blocked. A little scramble there at the 15. Looks like it's finally picked up by Union. Sula throws it down the side to Burns. Union just slowing it down again. They've eaten up a lot of clock in this half already. Mabardi to McAvoy. Cole Hartman will hop on, and so will Matt Blossy. Blossy oh. with a goal in this game. All those shot clock resets on this last possession. Five minutes already into the quarter, and I think Williams has only had the ball once. All right. McAvoy now dodging his defender. I'll hand that off to Hartman there on the far side. He'll give it to Blossy. Blossy will take a shot. Looks like it'll bounce off his defender's stick, but he'll maintain possession of the ball. Union, only 25 seconds left on the shot clock. Mabardi with it now, moving around. Over to McAvoy Brown, the back of the net to Burns. Inside to Shaw, scramble there. Williams will pick that ball up. That's long stick. Williams Defenseman. Has a, has a chance at transition opportunity here. They decide against it. Williams now subbing all of their midfielders. Trying to do it fast. The long pole midi gets an opportunity. Nothing there. Passes it back. Nicholson's been playing with that idea of the fake runoff all day. Finally got it, but there was a Union player in the hole to defend him. All right, good bar over to Shapiro at the 25. He'll run that in. Shapiro shot, blocked. Guarded by Nick Denave. He was unable to make that shot connect inside the goal. Looks like Patrick Riley's got the ball now, and he'll run that all the way up the field for Union. Hand it off to Burns and he'll hop off the field. In comes Kip, Davis, and Green for the Dutchman offense. All the Williams possessions so far this this ha this quarter have been just quick shots and out. Really not giving their offense a chance here. They've been surviving awfully well defensively for how long they've been playing. Trying to double here, it doesn't work. But Friedis bails him out. Able to get a clamp on the ball too. And it looks like we got a flag thrown over there at like the 44. Might be a penalty on Williams. Looks like it's an offsides penalty on Williams, that's why they were doubling there. Yeah, offsides penalty there on number eight, Bjorn Davidson. Definitely have to survive this if they want any chance. Still down by five points with seven minutes left. Very commanding lead for Union, but definitely not impossible for a comeback still. We've seen the Williams offense able to score, but with the amount of possession time Union's holding right now, they haven't had many opportunities this quarter. All right, Green will hand that off to Kip. Shaw around the back of the net for Mabardi and Burns. Kip with the shot now. He'll Kip. sink that one. Kip just wide open, sitting in that top corner. The Union play run to perfection. That's exactly what they were looking for, and Kip delivers. Yeah, right past the right-hand shoulder of Friedis into the net. Union will extend their lead to 6, 7.31 left to go in the game. Williams going to need to make some major headway here at the X if they want to regain any sort of possession and have a chance on the on the attack here. They got Dubre out here. Hasn't had much success today at the X, but if he had some magic in his bag, he's got to pull through now to try to break down this Union lead. He's able to tie up the faceoff, but Sula picks it up, not giving Williams a chance. Burns with the ball now. Again, yeah, I think their greatest weakness, you know, for Williams is that they can't really win on the faceoff here. 
Yeah, they've played they've played pretty well in most facets of the game. I mean, they've had a lot of turnovers, but they've caused just as many in Union. But this faceoff X has been killing them. Union's had so many more possessions, and especially in this corner, they've been able to hold the ball for two, three minutes possession. It gives the Williams offense almost no chance. Yeah, and super dangerous. You know, Union gets a goal, gets that momentum, and then wins the faceoff. Unable to really, you know, Williams is unable to stop them if they can't if they can't win it on the X. Yeah, it, it, they don't even have a chance at like having a scoring foot race because they don't have any opportunities with the ball. Yeah. Williams sliding aggressively here, trying to get the ball back. Kip with it now, dodging his defender. So fake a pass there. Tries to hammer one into the back of the net, but it's in the in the hands of Frida Snow for Williams. Williams with a quick clear of Com the field. Yeah, they'll complete that pass to Davidson over there on the far side. Now into the hands of DiPietro. Yeah, looks like they're gonna wait a little bit. DiPietro staying on the field. Now elects to run off. Williams needs to get a goal here. Five minutes left, down by six points. Good bar to Shapiro. Back to good bar here at the 40. He's guarded by Clint Godot. Shapiro. He'll hammer one in. Good save, Donahue. Donahue has just had a read on the Williams offense this quarter. Every shot that comes to him, he seems to know exactly where it's going. They haven't had a chance. Yeah, he's been fantastic, and lucky enough for him, he hasn't had had to face that many shots. Yeah, it's been only a few shots and a very few possessions this quarter, but Donahue stopped every one. Williams back on defense again. Five minutes left in the game. McAvoy over to Mabardi at the 30. Williams is going to keep playing aggressive. They've done a great job at it so far, but Union has had a few turnovers, but they've still been able to score very effectively. McAvoy over to Blasi. Blasi attacking the short stick, turns around. Pass behind, wraparound shot. Burns goes wide. Union able to pick it up. That's a reset on the shot clock also. Yeah, we got 435 left to play in the game here. Union up by six. Blossy with the ball now at the 20. He'll dodge around his defender, Matthew Johnson. Able to hand that off to to Shaw back to McAvoy and he'll take a shot and that one will sink McAvoy sinks one and that'll be his first goal of the season which is fantastic for the sophomore Archie McAvoy great job there just makes his man step off has a quick 14er and puts it in four minutes left now most uh, hopes of a comeback have been denied with a seven point lead for Union, especially with the inability we've seen for Williams to win faceoffs. Big celebration there from the Union bench. That's going to be McAvoy's first goal, or first collegiate goal here for, for Union, which is really great accomplishment. Super exciting. Union wins that faceoff, but we got a whistle. They're going to give it to Williams. Not too sure why, but we'll we'll roll with it here. It's like some kind of push or interference call, but not made very clear to us. Williams trying to push it instantly, but nothing there. Romrell and Bates, and then Shuckman here on the near side. Shuckman's got a little bit of space. Decides to dodge on the alley, puts a shot, goes right, right into, into the, the stick. stick. Yeah, easy save there for Donahue. Yeah, Donahue make the hard ones, but. Still gets the easy ones. Caputo trying to take that ball back from Donahue, and somehow he ends up on the ground. Donahue right in the middle of play. Ball on the ground. Williams just playing with all-out aggression here. Hands that off to McAvoy in his... And that is a time violation for Union, giving Williams back the ball. They're trying to sub quickly. Quick whistle, but Union's able to get their subs in first. Yeah, Foley and Denave will head on there for the Union defense. Union defense has been fantastic this game, only allowing four goals 
they have they've done they've done a phenomenal job at stopping what I think looks like a very good Williams offense. Ooh, looks Push like we might there. get a shove there. And there's the flag. Two yep. flags. Might even be on two separate players. All right, Foley will for sure come off here for Union and sit this this penalty. Jackson Maher, the sophomore, will head on there for Union. So will long stick John Sula. We haven't seen a super effective man up again with this Union team. Quite a few fouls this game. But Williams really hasn't made use of most of the opportunities. They mostly pass the ball around looking for some outside shots. I'd like to see them try to put in a feed or have a little more movement. And so here the Williams offense will move that ball around on the man up due to that pushing call on Seamus Foley. And, and somehow they, they give the ball away. And it, it's now in the stick of... Uh, of uh, Jack Thompson here for Union, or yeah, I'm sorry, Patrick Riley. That was just some great man down. Everyone had their sticks up. Williams tried to throw a through pass, but quickly got knocked down, and Sula got the ground ball. Now Union calls a quick timeout when their player's in trouble. Two minutes, 30 seconds left. Union has a seven-point lead along with the ball. Here we go. Last two minutes, 36 seconds of the game. Union leads 11 to 4. Union with the ball now here on the offense. I believe Zach Davis is going to start it off here for Union at the at the 20. Williams defense now just playing for some pride. They played really hard all game and honestly they've done a great job causing many turnovers. And Kip with a shot pretty much unguarded. Yeah. From the 25. I mean, there's not really much that Williams can do at this point. I think Williams was trying to get Kip behind the net there so they could uh, double team mm -hmm. and get the goalie outside of the net. But uh, they missed time it a little bit there, leaving an almost open net for Kip, and Kip's going to put that in 10 out of 10 times. Another face off here. Looks like. Williams has switched again. It's looking now like Kip will lead the Dutchman in goals so far this season. And that's picked up by Pilato there on the X, and he'll run it all the way straight to the goal. He'll take a shot. Got checked as he did it, or else that might have won in. Williams, Williams able to pick it up. Shaw really trying hard. They'll double team that defenseman there to try to get the ball back, but it still ends up in the sticks of the Williams defenseman and they'll unfortunately throw that ball away again that pass from Friedes uh, to his defenseman yeah, that's uh, Drew Nicholson that's definitely been a plague of Williams today they made quite a few mistakes uh, throwing the ball yeah Looks just a few bad long passes yeah especially when they've needed them uh, in transition here they got a takeaway yeah, that was a good takeaway by Eddie Lloyd. Williams does such a good job of getting takeaways on defense, especially you don't see a team like Union in settled offense give the ball up this much, but they offset their own takeaways through not being able to win at the faceoff X and just throwing the ball away and transition so often. All right, so that's Shapiro, Johnson, and Goodbar. Up top here for the attack 
for Williams. Quick shot, unable to, to capitalize on that is, uh, is Shapiro. So the ball will end up in the stick of Donahue. Union looking to take their time here, maybe run out the clock with a minute left to go in the game. Got slightly more time on the shot clock than we do on the game clock, so the game may end here. Union's definitely looking to maybe get one more goal up there on the board. Williams has a goalie out, but the ball's in front now. I don't know if Union will just shoot it. Normally the strategy is only employed when the ball's behind the cage. Kippen Davis running around with it. Davis at the U. Back to Kip at the 40 here. and The ball hits the floor. He'll kind of roll over the ball, and the ball is loose. You know, picked up by Ian DiPietro. Yeah, great ground ball there by DiPietro. Kind of gooses it out of trouble to himself and then able to pick it up. Williams now trying to clear. Yeah, 15 Lewis. 15 seconds left on the clock. Ball in the hands of Matthew Johnson now, who will run that upfield. Hand it off to Shapiro. Shapiro with one last dodge. Shoots and misses. He'll take one more shot there. Yeah, two seconds left to go in the game. And that'll end it here for Union and Williams. The final score, Union 12, Williams 4. And we'll see you guys back here on Saturday for our next matchup.